Hi, babies! <laughs> Hi, babies! We are Chili Sisters! Hi, guys! We have a guest today, Sunny! <laughs> Say hello! <laughs> Hi, babies! Today we have a special guest, Sunny! Sunny! Hi, guys! So, my name is Sunny. I used to work for Coco, and today I'm making a guest appearance. Welcome, Sunny! So, what is the topic today? So we're going to be talking about Sonny's favorite products, which is <laughs> fermented essences. Why do you like these? I guess. Why do you like fermented essences? My favorite thing about fermented essences is that they're super lightweight, really hydrating, and just, just you like it. <laughs> The reason for choosing this topic again is we got a lot of inquiries from our beauties that what's the difference between the old version of Misha, the first treatment essence, and the new version of it, and what's the difference to the new Gen 1 to Misha 1. So maybe we can talk a little bit about this one. Yes. And that's also your favorite, that's why we invite you yeah. to talk about it. Um, I actually know how essences first came to be invented. Right, oh. Tell me, you can tell okay. me. I think you're telling. <laughs> um, so, essences started when people went into the sake factories and the, a lot of the workers were really old. Mm -hmm. Except their hands had been dipped in fermented rice for years and years. Mm -hmm. And their hands were nice and smooth and youthful, okay. but they were old. So, what are essences? You don't care. No. So, what is the first treatment? Essence? Yeah. So what is the first essence treatment? Well, obviously it's not a toner. Um, it's categorized as an essence. Essences are supposed to quickly absorb into the skin. It has lots of benefits to the skin, like hydration. Brightening. Brightening. Mm -hmm. Yes, we had that one. <laughs> and aging. Yeah, anti -aging. Yeah, yeah, yes, thank you. Yes. Got out of my hair. <laughs> fermented ingredients works for your skin? I only know that the fermented ingredients absorb deeper into the skin than say other ingredients would. Mm. Yeah exactly. It's because once it's fermented by itself, the molecule itself is like smaller and smaller so it's really easy to get into your skin. Fermented ingredients are one of the key ingredients to K-beauty. It produces amino acids, vitamins and various antioxidants for the skin. Which is good for your skin, right? Which is like the perfect ingredient for the skin. They also um, naturally produce AHAs, which are really good ingredient for helping to exfoliate your skin and reveal a more healthy glowing appearance. Oh, that's why once you use this one, you can see like a bit of the glow mm. from your skin. Mm. Oh, right. I didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> Since fermentation mimics our natural cell functions, it prevents us from getting skin irritations. So when you apply the substance, it's like I've heard it and I've read something from the internet that we should like pat it down until get it absorbed with your hand temperature. Mm. That's because it's like mimicking the natural cells. So shall we talk about these? Um, Misha, the first treatment essence, the old version and new version. Mm -hmm. Have you tried these ones before? I've tried the old version, but mm. not the new one. Question. I've tried the old one, and I've also tried the SK2 one. Same. Which, like, the price is like, wow, the difference. You can get like four of these for the SK2. <gasps> True! Mm. Yeah. Oh my. It's like 130. I'm not too sure about that. I actually looked on Sephora and it was $204. Oh. $200. Oh, wow. Okay. So you can get the exact same effect from this one instead of buying one bottle of SK2. So I guess the main difference between the two would be this one contains Himalaya purple bark leaf. Oh, barley. Barley. <laughs> barley. <laughs> barley. <laughs> barley. <laughs> so this one contains Himalaya purple barley. 90%? And this one contains 95% of fermented secret properties. Yeah, and 
the fermented the technology is slightly different so they has been developed in the um, technology mm. so how they do is they fermented the ingredients in a hot temperature and cold temperature so the molecule itself is like smaller and smaller and we're getting smaller and smaller so it gets into your skin faster than the previous one and they're concentrating on more brightening and more hydrating Another good thing about the new one is, is that it's formulated without things like parabens and alcohol, which is a big one that a lot of people don't like. So that one is more for sensitive skin and dry skin. <laughs> I recommend it to my our beauties to use this one after toner, but if you want to replace your toner to this one, you have to use it with a cotton pad to wipe out, and then you need to put another layer on top of it. Do you have any personal way to use this one? Um, I just use it with my hands. Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> so the time evolution of the first treatment is since intensive moist. This type of fermentation provides a deeper and long-lasting hydration while it's also refining your skin texture as well. The ingredients from the Himalaya barley, the purple barley, hydrates your skin as well as strengthening your skin barrier. Which is actually not too bad for like a essence, but I, they made it better obviously mm -hmm. with the new one. Mm -hmm. So comparing to the third generations of the first treatment essence, and that's the fourth generation, which is the new version. So this one is anti-aging, like anti-wrinkle, whitening, and hydration. With 95 percent of Sika is fermented, that provides deep hydration to your skin. And that contains pro-ferment alpha. What is this? Nisha's own technology that they developed using hot and cold fermentation process and it helps to get everything into your skin. So um, it has been fermented twice, so it's highly concentrated ingredients that penetrate your skin fast. That's the key point of this new version. And the fermented essence that refines skin texture to create a clean and bright complexion. So if you've got dull skin tones or if you tend to get like fine lines around like 20s, 30s, mm. you tend to be, it's starting, it's a time to get like fine lines around <laughs> the eye area. So um, it's really good to get it prevented to get a fine line. Other textures are <clears throat> different. Yeah, oh, let's let's try it. Should we use your big hand? So maybe we can try the old one first and the new one. So I'll use my hand. That's really worrying. Oh, sorry. Let me try. Don't look at me. Oh, it comes with a bit of smell, like fermentation. It's like, like almost a toner, but yeah, but it shouldn't be used as a toner, but it can be used as a toner. Yeah, <laughs> but it's not a toner, but you can use it as a mm. toner. It's a bit more closer to an ampoule, but it's also not an ampoule, mm. but if you know what I mean. <laughs> it's acid, <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> so the good thing about this one is it's the same 150 mils. Um, normally when products are reformulated, their size gets bigger or smaller. Which normally smaller. Normally <laughs> smaller <laughs> than the yeah. previous one. Normally smaller, which is, which is good because they haven't changed. The good thing about this one is at the back it says you should write when you've opened it. So not like other essences, we, we normally should be using it within one year, but then obviously a lot of people don't follow by that and I personally don't because I feel like it's a waste because mm -hmm. I can never finish this within a year like oh, oh. As, you, as, you know, <laughs> as you know I'm a lazy I'm the lazy one so if you can see here the open date is just kindly written there <laughs> which is quite helpful I personally think whereas the old version has a heap of a lot of Korean words <laughs> Too much information. Too much information. Yeah, you can try with the cotton pack. Yeah, Sony, show us. <laughs> show us. Show us. You can try it. I'll try the new one. Yeah. How does it feel? It feels nice. 
I can smell. We can I try. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> I actually can't smell much. Oh yeah. Like comparing to the previous one, it doesn't have any smell. Mm. Oh, more like the water. That's well, really hydrated. So when you pat it down, you can use your hand to just pat it down. It's because of oh, what? <laughs> Cut. So old one's got a bit of scent in it, and that's still hydrating. But in between these two, just different key ingredients, which is Himalayan, the barley fermented ingredients, ninety percent. But that one comes with more percentage of the fermented ingredients, so it works for hydrating brightening, anti-aging. So I think this product is more effective than the previous generations and also good for the sensitive skin so don't be uh, too afraid to use the fermented ingredients. Just go for it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, yeah. so next up. That's Sunny's favorite, favorite, favorite essence. Why? 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 You know what? Uh, I remember when you wrote for us, mm. you keep asking us, do you, where is it coming in? <laughs> yeah. Do you have any plan to stop them in? So what's good about this Neogen one is that it has 93% <laughs> <laughs> 93 93 of natural fermented ingredients, as well as 28% of Saccharomyces fermented poultry. So what is the second ingredient? Saccharomyces fermented poultry. What? <laughs> what is that? Saccharomyces. 17% birch juice, which is really good for hydration, and 9% of rice extract. And that helps with brightening. Right, right. So every good ingredient for the brightening, hydration, all in one. Yes. Okay. I heard it also has the um, eye drop. Yeah, the eye drops. <laughs> what? The eye drops, the thing of bulbs. Does it contain the eye drop? <laughs> so can we put this one into our eyes? No, it's like safe around the eye area. Oh. Oh. You just said <laughs> Some of the pros about this product is that it has a pH level of 5, so it's gonna help to really balance your skin. Um, it also is fragrance free for people who don't like fragrances in their products. Um, cons. I don't really have any. Oh. <laughs> Beginning of using this one, I feel like, oh, it's like a toner. Mm. What is the main ingredients? But uh, I think because as I talked to our beauties before, thousands of times, my skin is super sensitive with like tea so it's oily and dry as well. But this one did, I didn't get any irritations out of it. So that's good. But just texture itself. A little bit goes a long way. Oh, I think so. Yeah. Um, I put this on with my hands and then pat it in. Generally, I only put one layer. Alright. Only because it's, it's, it's still kind of expensive. You can't say that. <laughs> you can't say that, man. <laughs> Have you tried this one before? No, I haven't. Try, try. I actually bought it without trying the tester. I know. <laughs> you know, I remember once we stopped them, you just bought it straight yeah. away, right? Oh, okay. Because it's no scent mm -hmm. and it's really light in texture, so I feel like it's a, just water. <laughs> <laughs> I apply water on my skin. Yeah, it's actually quite similar to the Sunjong Tone. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, wow. exactly. It's like fully absorbed already. Yeah. It's so I've got combination skin and I'm using this one at the moment. I found that actually it, it's really hydrating on the outer dry areas as well as it helps to control the oil production in my T-zone. So that's really good. So question, which one do you guys like the most? Because <laughs> I, I know. <laughs> what about you? Uh, uh, this one is my favorite because I like the texture itself and I trust their new technology <laughs> must be really good. <laughs> what about yours? I don't know. I I know what's the answer. <laughs> Why should we use the best treatment? <laughs> Why do we even need an essence? <laughs> 
So our most asked question was, which one of the three is the best? Yeah. Um, we don't have an answer to that. Obviously, it's different for everyone. Um, everyone will just have to try each and every one and see which one's best for them. Anything to say? To summarize up? Buy them. What? <laughs> <laughs> It was really interesting talking about the difference between the two essences because I haven't actually tried this one yet because it is a new product. Mm -hmm. So it's good to learn some new things about that. If you have any other further questions, please comment down below or call us. <laughs> if you have any other further questions, comment down below, like us, and also subscribe us. And stay tuned! Bye, Bye ladies! Let us be pretty! Don't be shy. What, what did you put on your forehead? What? Oh, I'm sweating already. Oh, oh I'm sweating. I thought you put on a uh, mask. <laughs> no. no. Just really short, short paragraph. You don't have to be nervous. I am. It's okay. Oh, give me that. Give me that. I'm okay. I'm so sorry. I'm just going to help you. Oh, you don't have to be too nervous. If you don't like it, we can edit it. No, it's just hot. Oh, okay. 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 And then you got to smile, okay? Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh my it's God. okay. I have a hey, oh, Kumbunga memory. I'm sorry. Ah, <laughs> nah. Oh, no. Spider-Man. Oh, wow. Okay. Spider-Man. <laughs> 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 <laughs>